All right, so the final one that I'm gonna do is the 30 degree drip stain. I've already created my 90, 75, 60, and 45s. And as you can see, they become more elliptical shape as you decrease the degree, the degree angle of impact. So this is 60 degrees that my board is measured at. So that means that my stain is gonna hit the board at a 30 degree angle. So I'll try to make three again. These do become a lot harder as the degree angle decreases. So let me see, I don't have too much in here. I'm trying not to get a lot of air in there just because then it makes the, the stains have little bubbles in them. Right, let's see, hopefully this works. I'm gonna go at about two feet. So one, two, Three. It came out perfect. So these are obviously more elliptical and what's cool about these is you can actually start to see what you would see in an elliptical stain where they have a tail. So like impact spatter stains you can tell what direction they hit the surface because they have a little tail. So the tail points in the direction of impact. This would be called an associated drop or a satellite stain because it's obviously connected to that blood stain, but it's just really an artifact um, of the degree angle of impact. So a little bit of blood, it, once it hits the surface, it kind of projects out in the same direction. And it's obviously in the same, it's lined up with that stain. So it has the same directionality as the elliptical stain. So these came out perfect. I'm glad that I didn't make a mess all over my table. So once I get done with all of these, I'm gonna let them dry and I might even laminate them just so I can use them as a reference for teaching. But this is how you create uh, drip stains at different degree angles of impact. So drip stains can obviously be created on any surface. They can be created on tables, floors, walls, whatever that surface is that somebody's dripping blood onto. So this is Jeff Gentry, BPA, blood stain pattern analyst, just showing how you create drip stains at different degree angles of impact.